Okay, I'm with Cam Calcoon and uh, just talking to Cam about some of the, the reasons why he's hit the ground running and it's, uh, he was just telling me it's only been three years and in that three years uh, he has just done just about every company there is in New Zealand. And Cam, one of the things you mentioned to me was, um, I always think of you as an inspirational speaker and a motivational speaker, but you were telling me it's also about more than that. It's about showing people how you have built a business from the ground floor. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, so um, when I started speaking, you know, everyone was saying, oh, how can you do that full time in New Zealand? And I heard what was being said, but I, I, I realised that I had a bigger dream. Like, I wanted to take this to the world, so this was where I had to start really setting my goals of, of sending out 40 emails every week. From those 40 emails, I had to be making 20 phone calls because nothing sells like mouth to ear communication. And so all those, you know, I did that solidly for the first three months and that built a groundswell that was totally outside of my comfort zone, but it got me on the platform to the point where I was speaking three, four times a week. And then all I had to realise is that that was the best place to generate word of mouth interest from. And so as long as I'm speaking well, I will continue to achieve what I need for my business. So you've, you've just built your business from, from personal contact, word of mouth, uh, you've been overseas, you've done the things you wanted to do, you've been to New York, yeah. Um, yeah, and you said to me it's all to do with sort of getting back to the, the, the old fashioned way of building business, you know, talking to people on the phone and, and following up. And yeah, building relationships, you know, and everyone does a, a Christmas card and a New Year card and I think that's great, but what I do is I do mine a month into the New Year because at that point everyone's got back to work, they've cleared all the Christmas cards, there were hundreds of Christmas cards and then my one comes in with a New Year approach and design in a way that will stay on someone's desk until the next one comes through. And so it's all those things of looking and I guess in growing up with cerebral palsy, you've always look for how can I maximise something that's different and unique. And so that's when I'm working with corporates, when I'm working with school students, when I'm working with government organisations, it's all about how do we build our personal brand to excel in our dreams personally and professionally. Well, you know, I've, I've always seen you as an inspirational speaker and, and that's how I've tended to pitch you, but I can now see that uh, why you're getting such uh, uptake and uh, interest from people who are either running their own businesses, people in real estate, people in insurance, people who have to build that business. Because if they don't build the business, they, that's, their product is, is uh, you know, it doesn't really matter. They've got to get the business, they've got to get the people wanting their product. Totally, and it comes down to that personal drive and what you're aiming for. And the way I see a, a conference is the conference is a place to come in and give that information and resources and networks you need to be better at what you do. My goal then is to, is to further inspire as to what is possible when we really dream big and I guess leave no stone unturned in our pursuit towards excellence. That's fantastic. I always get inspired uh, sitting with you and uh, having a coffee, so thanks for that Cam and I'm sure that uh, many of the people that I work with will want to know a little bit more about you. Cool. Thanks, mate.